Hello, my name is Captain Helton with the North Carolina Wildlife Resources Commission Law Enforcement Division. I would like to take this opportunity to tell you about the shooting hours for game animals, non-game animals, upland game birds, and migratory game birds, and how to determine the legal shooting times using the North Carolina Inland Fishing, Hunting, and Trapping Regulations Digest. For the examples I will be talking about in this video, a hunter will need to be properly licensed or legally exempt from the hunting license requirement. A detailed discussion of North Carolina license requirements and exceptions can be found in the license requirements and exceptions sections of your North Carolina Inland Fishing, Hunting, and Trapping Regulations Digest. To determine the legal shooting hours for game animals and upland game birds, turn to the Sunrise and Sunset table in the back of the Regulations Digest. At the top of the table, locate the month and to the left, locate the date. Follow the month column and date row until they intersect. This intersection point will be the sunrise and sunset time for Charlotte, North Carolina. For the specific county you will be hunting, notice the county chart on the lower half of the page. To the right of each county is the time difference in minutes that differ from Charlotte. Depending on the county chosen, the minutes will be added or subtracted from the times given in the table. The definition of game animals includes bear, fox, squirrel, rabbit, and white-tailed deer. It also includes bobcat, possum, and raccoon except when trapped in accordance with provisions relating to fur-bearing animals. Upland game birds are defined as grouse, pheasant, quail, and wild turkey. Game animals and upland game birds may only be taken between 30 minutes before sunrise and 30 minutes after sunset with the exceptions of raccoons and possums which may be taken at night. It is unlawful to shoot raccoons during the daytime west of US-1 except in Richmond County. This applies to private and public property. Please refer to the game land section in the Regulations Digest for possible shooting hour exceptions or closed days on game lands you plan to hunt. Using the example of bear hunting in Cherokee County on October 15, 2018, let's find the legal shooting times together. At the top of the table, locate the month, October, and to the left, locate the day, 15th. Follow the month column and the day row until they intersect. This will be the sunrise and sunset time for Charlotte. Now, subtract 30 minutes from the sunrise for the morning shooting time and add 30 minutes to the sunset to find the legal shooting time in the evening in Charlotte. On the bottom chart, find Cherokee County. To the right is plus 13. Add 13 minutes to the legal shooting times for Charlotte and you will have the correct shooting times for Cherokee County on October 15, 2018. Non-game animals for which a season is set may be taken during the hours and methods authorized for taking game animals. These animals include groundhog, nutria, striped skunk, armadillo, coyote, and feral swine. Unless otherwise specified, shooting hours for all migratory game birds, including waterfowl, are half hour before sunrise to sunset. Migratory game birds are migratory birds for which open seasons are prescribed by the United States Department of Interior, which include wild ducks, geese, brant, swans, wild doves, little brown cranes, rails, coots, gallinules, woodcock, and snipe. Please refer to the NC Inland Fishing, Hunting, and Trapping Regulations Digest for additional information on hunting migratory game birds in North Carolina. Feral swine and coyotes may also be taken on private lands anytime, day or night. Feral swine and coyotes may only be taken on public land without a permit during the open season on game animals and upland game birds and from the hours of one half hour before sunrise until one half hour after sunset and from one half hour after sunset to one half hour before sunrise by permit only. Feral swine may only be taken with the use of dogs on game lands during the bear deer dog season. However, this does not include taking of feral swine on bear sanctuaries with dogs. Feral swine may only be taken on bear sanctuaries during the deer archery, deer black powder, deer gun, 
for small game seasons use the only weapons and manner of take prescribed for that season. It is illegal to take feral hogs with dogs on a bear sanctuary. Coyotes may be taken on private lands any time, day or night, except in Beaufort, Dare, Hyde, Terrell, and Washington counties. For these five counties, the following apply. Hunting hours are one half hour before sunrise to half hour after sunset. All coyote hunting requires a permit. A coyote hunting permit may be obtained at ncwildlife.org or by calling one 888 2486834. Any coyote taken in these five counties must be reported to the North Carolina Wildlife Resources Commission as detailed on the permit within 24 hours. Coyotes may not be hunted on public land in Beaufort, Dare, Hyde, Terrell, or Washington counties except by the holder of a permit for a specific special hunt opportunity for coyotes. We recommend anyone considering hunting coyotes in Beaufort, Dare, Hyde, Terrell, or Washington County, review the section of your NC Regulations Digest entitled, Before You Shoot. Know the difference between red wolves and coyotes. It is important to note that where local laws govern hunting or conflict with North Carolina Wildlife Commission rules, the local law shall prevail. Thank you for taking this time to watch our video. We hope that you have a safe and enjoyable time on your next outdoor adventure. For more information on hunting, fishing, boating, trapping, or educational opportunities, please visit our website at ncwildlife.org.